Hello guys, this is Jin. I've cycled the world for nearly 10 years. I made the most asked question list and I'll answer them today. Please watch it then because I put some important questions a lot. Where were you from? North Korea? How old are you now? 30s? How old were you when you started cycling trip? 20s? What did you study? Computer science? But I dropped after two years that I don't remember even what I studied. What was your job? Office worker? Did you have a cycling trip before? Yes, just one year before I leave, I went to Jeju Island and I had a 9 day cycling trip. When did you start cycling trip? September 1st, 2011. Where did you start cycling from? San Francisco, United States. Why bicycle? Car is too fast, walking is too slow, bicycle has a good speed. What was the goal of this trip? I wanted to explore the world and have a new experience. I want to learn different cultures and meet people around the world and I want to grow from my own experience. Did you plan this long distance trip from the beginning? No. How many continents have you cycled? Six continents? How many countries have you traveled? 74 countries. How many kilometers have you cycled so far? 84,000 kilometers. How many kilometers do you cycle per day? 70 to 80 kilometers average per day. How many hours do you cycle per day? 8 to 12 hours I'm outside on the road. The longest distance you've cycled in one day? 260 kilometers in China. What's the fastest speed? 80 kilometers. What is your favorite continent? Latin America? What's your favorite country? Mexico for everything. Viva Mexico! <laughs> and Peru, Bolivia, Turkey, Iran for culture. But in general, I like where I am mostly now. What is the best country for food? South Korea. <laughs> and after it, my favorite country food is Mexico, Turkey, Ethiopia, Spain, China, Malaysia. What was the best place to cycle? I like desert, snow, high mountain. Which countries are the kindest people to let you camp easily at their property? Colombia, Paraguay, Sudan, South Africa, Finland. Which country has kindest people welcoming you? France and Myanmar. People all around the world are very generous and kind and I always appreciate them. But I actually remember these two countries, They, when I have eye contact, they always smile. The safest country to cycle, Netherlands, because there is a bicycle path everywhere. And this is the only one country in the world which has bicycle path everywhere. The safest country to travel, Western European country. Which place do you recommend to cycle for a beginner? Western European countries. Which place do you recommend to cycle for adventurous people? Pamir Highway and Salar de Uyuni in Bolivia. Do you get money from family? No. How do you finance working online? Like building websites or writing for magazine, many others. You can check the other videos I made about this. The most successful was uh, creating contents and getting donations. How do you take the money out from the bank? ATM. How do you secure your bags and bicycle when you go to the toilet? Surprising is saying no one ever trying to touch my bicycle in six countries while traveling the world. And I got the habit that I actually don't like my bicycle when I go to the toilet. And I always put in front of entrance door so there's a camera. What is dangerous thing while traveling? Car accident. I was hit by car over four times when it's fully loaded. And also one time by motorbike. Have you met any thieves? No. Any bad thing happens on the travel? Not really. Usually the bad thing is more like car accident and sexual harassment. Did you have any insurance? No. What do you do when you're sick? When I'm sick, I just try to cycle to the next town and look for a place to stay. Or if I'm terribly sick, I hitchhike to the next town. How many bicycles have you used for cycling around the world? Only one bike. What's your bike brand? Shirley Long Hard Trucker. How much was it? $750. I found this bicycle at Craigslist secondhand website. Someone built with a new frame and then some part was old and new. What's your wheel size? 26 inch. How heavy is your bicycle? 18 kilogram with the logs and everything included like this. How many flat tires did you have? I never counted but usually once 
every month. I use Shiro V Marathon Plus. This is for touring bicycle that is very strong so I don't get flat tire often. What do you do when your bicycle is broken? I try to fix and if I can't fix and the bicycle doesn't move anymore then I just eat check. How much weight is your luggage? It really depends. 35 to 45. So if it's winter I carry a lot and also if I do wild camping I carry food, waters, many things. But if it's really hot country, then there's cheap afford restaurant, then I carry way less. Why do you carry many things? Why not? <laughs> It's not holiday, my life on the road, so I like to carry whatever I want. Isn't it too difficult on uphill with all luggage? Not really. How do you find the wild camping spot? Check small road. Usually if you follow the small road on the big road, there's some place to do wild camping. And you can use Google Maps, like satellite and street views, so you can check the, what kind of terrain there, or is there any fence. It is safe to do wild camping, yes and no. Unlike our scary imagination, usually nothing really happens, but you never know. So I can't really guarantee. But anyway, I survive. How do you prepare for the visa? Research on online. Every passport has different visa requirement, and you must check the information related to your passport. How do you plan for the route? I decide which country I will go by just looking map. What do you use for navigation? I use uh, MapsMe and Google Map. MapsMe is an offline map that you can download the map when there's internet, and you can use even when there's no internet. Do you have a filter for water? No. How do you charge the phone? Use power bank. I can charge for 2-3 days. I use this as a GPS, so it's very important not to use too much to keep the battery. And I can charge my phone and these things when I stop at cafe or gas station or when I sleep inside. How do you take the picture and video when you're alone? I use tripod or the timeless, the function that it keep taking pictures so I can have some natural picture. And I ask people how to speak with the local people who can't speak English. Body language and Google Translator. Aren't you scared? Yes. I'm very scared. Very often. And many times. But I just live with the fear because I like this. So I just learned that to live with the fear is fine. What really not okay thing is that just give up without trying because of the fear. How to cope with the loneliness? Accept it. To feel lonely is very human nature, whether you travel or not. What's the hard thing on the world trip? Mm, discrimination, finding place to sleep before sunset, and farewell. Why cycling alone? I couldn't find a cycling partner who can follow me six continents. <laughs> but when I meet some other people, I cycle together. And when our road is separate, we say goodbye. What do you like most on your trip? To eat, to meet people, to take shower after long day cycling, and to see some rice after scaring camping night alone. What you don't like most on the trip? To say goodbye to people I like and I love. What makes you keep traveling? Curiosity. I'm curious about everything and I actually ask quite a lot of questions whenever I meet people. And I think this is the biggest motivation make me keep cycling because I'm always wondering what's next. Did you enjoy traveling even after so many years? Yes, because of the curiosity. Did you regret your trip at some point? No, even on the step up hill, I always knew why I, I was cycling. Which lesson did you get on your trip? There is more than one story. The media always talk about only one side. They make uh, our view very narrow. But then when I travel, I see many different stories. I think this is a really important lesson. There's more than one story. Will you travel by bicycle in the future again after finishing this trip? Yes. I want to travel with this friends and just short trip. Where do you want to travel in the future? New country I have never been and the country where my friends live. Have you been changed after the long trip? Not really. I'm just Jin, just like before. The only thing changed is that I got beautiful memories. That's enough. Any advice to people dreaming of traveling the world? Just try it. 
I didn't have any experience with cycling overseas and I didn't have enough money and I was so scared at everything but look I've made it <laughs> I think if you really crazily want something you will make it thank you so much for watching to the end see you on next video